the internet, as beautiful and nice as it is, it's got a lot of scams. A lot of scams. You won't believe it. Today, we're going to look at some of the scams, okay? We're going to look at some of the scams that are taking place on the internet. Yes, of course, you are free to have friends from any part of the world, but are they really your friends? When you are making friends on the internet, you need to try and check the profiles of those friends that you are making, especially if they are going to be really close friends. Because on Facebook, you have, for example, a profile of a 17-year-old, but basically what they did was they went to someone else's profile, probably someone who speaks Portuguese, you know what I'm saying? And they downloaded all the photos of that person, all right? Maybe that person is, is just a kid, 17 years old or 18 years old. They download all the photos and create another profile in English because they are just assuming that, well, this one speaks English, that one speaks Portuguese, so they'll never be friends anyway. They create an English profile and try to make friends with you. And you'll be like, oh, I've got this friend. You know what I'm saying? We're age mates. Are you really age mates? Because behind the scenes, it's not your age mate who is acting. It's probably just a thief. You see what I'm saying? Someone far much older whose aim is to just do something, some harm to you. You finish your grade 12. We can offer you a modeling job. We can offer you so and so type of job. All you have to do is to just fill in these papers, all right? Then we'll send you an air ticket and you can come and work for us, okay? But for us to send you that air ticket, you need to pay some money. And you'll be like, hey, after all, it's just a $200. Pa, you pay. But you're not the only one they're doing that to. They're doing that to another 100, 200, 300, 400 people. You see what I'm saying? And you know what? The moment they receive that money, something will go wrong. And you will never see that air ticket. You will never see that job coming. They've just stolen your money. This is very common right now on the internet. Those people who are, you know, that relationship urge, someone could just strike a relationship with them. And basically when they strike that relationship, that person will start to study that person, study, study, study that person. Then later on, they just come up with something like, oh, there's a problem, you know, um, I have to attend to A, B, C, and I'm, I'm short, can you just lend me maybe a 500 or a 1,000, depending on your status, because they've, they've studied you, so they know what you're capable of affording. You know what I'm saying? If you're a high-profile person, they'll ask maybe for a 2,000 US. You know what I'm saying? Dollars. If you're not a high-profile person, they just ask for something like maybe a $200. But they're not doing that to just you alone. They're doing that to so many other people. You know what I'm saying? And basically, they are scamming you.